How does the roadside weed Arabidopsis beat revolution's game of luck? In this video, researchers Detlef Weigel and Gray Monroe explain the most recent groundbreaking findings that were published in Nature. Mutations are damage to our genetic material. Normally, mutations are being repaired, they disappear again but a few mutations remain. They are being passed on to the next generation and they are ultimately the fuel of evolution. We have been interested in sequencing the genome of hundreds of plants of Arabidopsis. So Arabidopsis is kind of the lab rat of plants. It's a model system for genetics. And what we found is that there's patches of the genome that have um, exceptionally low mutation rates. And when we look deeper, what we discovered is that these are the places in the genome that are contributing the most important genes to biological function um, in this plant. These genes, which are particularly important, they are in a different epigenetic state than the genes that are less important. And so being in a different epigenetic state helps certain regions of the genome to attract DNA repair machinery more efficiently. We are becoming better and better at um, forecasting what will happen to populations in the future under global change, whether they have um, already the mutations that they might need in future to withstand higher temperature or drier environment and so on. And if they don't have these mutations already, then of course it's important to calculate could they acquire these new mutations just through random mutagenesis. So we want to connect this with predictive models that take onto board what is actually the rate at which these genes in principle could change. 